Welcome to HDTV, you're now rocking with your boy. Mount Rushmore, Mount Rushmore term is offensive and should be retired. ESPN's Jalen Rose says, you know, and Jalen Rose says that the Mount Rushmore should be offensive to everyone. ESPN's Jalen Rose is challenging people to stop using the term Mount Rushmore. The term is normally used when naming the four greatest in a certain category. The term derives from Mount Rushmore National Memorial, built on Mount Rushmore in South Dakota, which depicts former presidents George Washington, Thomas Jefferson, Theodore Roosevelt, and Abraham Lincoln. Rose wants to cancel the term because the monument was built on top of dead bodies of Native Americans whose land was taken from them. So, um, here's Jalen Rose basically saying it. Why do you think Washington changed your name from Redskins? I do a show and didn't say that word for eight years. And my co-host David Jacoby, we both said they're going to change the name on that. Why? Because it's offensive. What about the Cleveland Indians? Same thing. Why did they change the name? Because it's offensive. So I want to continue to challenge myself and to challenge you to do something. Can we retire using Mount Rushmore? That should be offensive to all of us, especially Native Americans, indigenous people, who were the first people here before Christopher Columbus. That land was stolen from them when it was discovered that it contained gold. And 25 years later, to add insult to injury, four American presidents were put on what we call Mount Rushmore on the top of the dead bodies that is buried right underneath. So I call for you and for myself. I'm on to this too. Let's stop using the term Mount Rushmore. When we're talking about our favorite rappers, we're talking about our favorite movies, we're talking about our favorite players. I know you're going to see this video, and I know you're going to take action. So that was what Jalen Rose said, you know, basically saying, real, you know, basically telling you. Now... My thing is, I never, you know, I've never basically ever said my, my, my Mount Rushmore of anything. Like, to me, I always say my top five. Um, in basketball, I say my top five. Or football, by position, I say my top five. Um, anything you always refer to, it. even in music, you say your top five or, you know, you split it up, your top five lyricists, your top five artists, your, your top five, you know, you know, whatever you want to equate it to. But Mount Rushmore, no, I mean, nobody ever really uses that because it's only four people. So you're only going to put four people in basketball. Like if you, and you know, it's like, come on. You know, and, and CNN, basically, um, they've been critical of Mount Rushmore, calling it a monument of two slave owners. The memorial was built in 1927 and was added to the U.S. National Register of Historic Places, October 15, 1966. Now, you know, not to dispute um, what um, Jalen is saying. Yes, the Indians were here, but blacks were here as well. It wasn't just the Indians. So, you know. So, you know, this this is the thing that I don't use it. Do I agree with Shannon? I mean, excuse me, I said Shannon. Do I agree with Jalen? So, you know. You know, I don't I don't really see the big deal because I don't talk about Mount Rushmore, but he has a point. 
you know, it is disrespectful to the indigenous people, but I wish people stopped saying just the Indians, the Native Americans. There were blacks here as well, the Moors. There were other blacks here besides the Moors. You know, it wasn't just the Native Americans that, you know, we, we have to, you know, we're always doing for others, but yet nobody wants to do anything for us. And that's the, the problem that I'm having. You know, I mean, I understand, you know, people saying you got to be sensitive to others, but why should I be sensitive when others aren't sensitive to our, to us? You know, we, we've been here, we were here already, you know, and then, you know, we were dragged from other places as well as we lived here and we were getting put in slavery by being here because of a, because of a color of your skin. So I feel where Jalen Rose is coming from, but. To me, I don't use Mount Rushmore. Everybody always uses top five. Like from since a kid, I've been up since a kid, since to now. I've never heard anybody say, yo, you're wishing Mount Rushmore. Like that's like out of the blue. And I tell people, I don't have a Mount Rushmore. I have five. I have a top five. And I tell people it. So, you know, that's just how it is. But, you know, let me know in the comment section, you know, what you guys feel. How do you feel about what Jalen Rose said? Do you agree with him? Do you disagree with him? Do you feel that people need to stop using the Mount Rushmore words so it stops being offensive to people? You know, just asking a question. You know, this isn't nothing we need to go crazy over. But I mean, if it's offensive, then yeah, I would think about not using it. But like I said, I don't really hear people talk about it. I mainly hear people in the media do it. I don't rarely hear people who are who are doing it, you know, who um, are fans of the game. So thank you for listening. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, share this. Hit that notification bell to select all. So you can receive upcoming notifications. So if you guys love what you hear, you can um, go to my description box. Hit that link to my cash app where you can donate whatever your hearts desire. You guys can also super chat while, while the video is live or if the video is premiering. Now, if you're not able to super chat at that time, you can super chat afterwards and it would be... Um, you can super chat afterwards and um, you can do a super thanks. You know, super thanks has really helped as well. So, thank you guys, man, for your blessings. Um, out right now is my top 10 point guards ever. I gave my top 10 list. Make sure you go check it out to see who I had from 10 to 1. You know, it's going to surprise a lot of people. A lot of people aren't going to like it. Some people are going to like it. Some people are going to disagree. It is what it is, so... Thank you guys for your love, your blessings, and thank you guys for tuning in. We out. Deezy.